Welcome back to all my fellow videos. Returning here to the Skyrim, right where we left off. Well, a little after what we left off. I, I went up, I talked to all of the companion leaders, and none of them have a job for me. It says that they do. If you look right here, it says talk to the companion leaders for work. But... Um, I did that, and nothing. So, I did pick up this, which is, uh, retrieving the nettle, nettle vein to repair the gilded green there in the, uh, courtyard. Um, and I trained a little bit in blocking. Other than that, um, I've, been, I've not done anything else. I do need to convince Braith to, uh, Leave Lars here alone, but we have to catch Braith at the right time to do that. And I've yet to catch her. So, I'm not sure on the companions what I need to do to, uh, get, um, the next quest to start. I don't know if that was a issue that we had from the last video or not. I'm, I'm not really sure. So, going to have to, uh, you sold it. Why are you standing over here and not? Okay. So, I'm not sure what's going on with that, you guys. I figured what we might do is, um, just kind of go out and see what kind of trouble we might be able to get into. That's Mila. Yeah, I'm not looking for you. So anyways, guys, that's, that's kind of where I'm at. I, I'm... I just don't know what to select up there to get them to Heinezine. To get them to give me the next companion quest. And I haven't been um, on the forums or anything. That dude is, I swear, going to get a arrow, sniped arrow from somewhere. So, I'm not sure, you guys. I, I just, I don't know where to go to um, get the next thing to go. So, I think what we will do is maybe head down and um, See what needs to be done elsewhere, and then we'll come back to the companions um, after I figure it out. So I, I, I don't, I just don't know what to do on that. So that's the plan anyway, and I think we're actually going to go and run by Riverwood real quick. And pick up another companion there. Rather than using the Earthgird. And, or Uthgird, however she says her name. I think we will go and pick up another companion there. Not particularly, no. And, uh, then we might go on ahead and head down and talk to the, <coughs> pardon me, talk to the Jarl at Falkreath, because we do have a quest to go talk to the Jarl at Falkreath. So that is the plan. And um, 
after doing a lot of checking into it and stuff, you guys, there are a number of compatible mods for um, the Skyrim Remastered, but um, and not enough to be able to transfer this game over to it. And to be real honest, um, Skyrim Remastered looks great, runs nice and decent, um, that kind of thing. However, on this particular series of playing here, there that we're currently playing, um, I have like 70 mods on this game. And there's just not going to be that kind of mod support in the special edition as of yet. It's just not going to happen for a long while. And there's no need to try to start a playthrough in special edition when it's not going to have everything the way I want, the way I've got this game set up to be played and everything. So there's just, there's no, re no need, no reason in which to do it. And because of that, I'm not going to. That is a mercenary. That's not who I was talking about getting. I know you. No, you don't. I haven't stolen anything, have I? Um, maybe I have. You're a wanted man. It's time to pay for your crime. Um, yeah, I'm the Yarl's thing. Oh, forgive me, Fay. I didn't realize it was you. We'll look the other way this time. But even the Yarl's influence has its limits. Be more careful. Okay. Did I take or do something? I didn't realize I did. If I, if I did, I did not realize I did. Um, that's Embry. Hi, Embry. Okay. Anyways, that was weird. So yeah, because of that, there's, I'm just gonna stick with playing the regular Skyrim. Um, it runs well. I have it set up, and minus some graphical improvements, you're just not going to notice anything. Yeah, I have. I was looking for, um, Vandal, but I can't find him. Because that's who I was going to take with me. I don't want to take that mercenary. Hmm, maybe he's out here by the uh My father is Alvor, the blacksmith. Yes, I know. I need a place. Um Maybe he's out here. By sure. It's my boy Sven you need to listen to. He sings at the inn most every night. Yeah, bounce Sven. Here for work? Got business here in Riverwood, eh? There are worse villages. This is true, there are many worse villages. I hear aha, there's Bandel. Thank you. Alright guys. So let's um let's come over here and let's head towards Falkreath. Um, Unisource, oh. Unisource, seriously. Are you a hunter by chance? Uh, do you have a, um, horn, buddy? That you can follow with? Oh, don't tell me he's just gonna run everywhere. Oh, he is. Um, 
Let me look at my convenient horses. Followers. Followers horses. Do that. There we go. I had to give him the ability. Awesome. All right. Now then, let's look at our map. We are uh, currently right here. We are headed to Falkreis. We're going to have to go up by Helgen and circle down. Place a marker, yes. Okay. Which is down that way. That's right, you tell him, Fando. And we're back. Sorry about that, guys. I had a um, message come in, and it caused my game to momentarily lock up. So, but I got it fixed. So... We're, we're literally just seconds. I mean, the message popped up, and when it did, I uh, went to Alt-Tab to it, and it messed it all up. Fall Creek is this way. That right there, you guys, is a mod that's called Point the Way. And it puts these little signposts up everywhere so you can see where it is that you're going while you're on the road. That is nice and convenient. Oh, I forgot how much Fandel talks. Oh, I should be a little bit more careful with Unisaurus, I'll tell you that right now. Uh, yes, I know, it looks like we're passing up a whole bunch of things, which, well, because we are, but those will be things that we come back for. Right now, it's off to Fall Creek. Let's look and make sure we're still headed the same, the right direction. We should have cut through the pass right there. Okay, next major left, though. Somebody's horse standing out in the middle of nowhere. Alright, and Fall Creek is this way. See how those signs come in so handy, you guys. You, you'll you actually help keep yourself from getting lost out here, because Skyrim is so large, it is so easy to get lost. It is ridiculous. Hey, Fandel, careful with your horse back there, buddy. Where is... Hey, 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 don't talk to me like that. Where are we? Oh. Okay, we need to go that way. Alright, we're, we're going right. Fandel, dude, dude, get off of me. Rude. I have not seen the shrine yet. Here is Fall Creek, you guys. So 
We have made it. Uh, no? Some moles, no dogs. I'm hoping, Bandel, that you don't get attacked by a dragon, because if you get attacked, that means I do. Okay. Now then, let's remove this uh, mark, because we're here. Yarls. And he's going to want to likely send me on a quest for one thing or another. Because that's how all these Yarls are. I serve under Jarl Sidgir and Jarl Dengir before him. Ooh. Okay, nice to meet you. Hello, Ian. What is it that you want? Um, you, you asked for me to come here, pal. Um, speak with the Jarl of Falkreath. Good to see you. Difficult. I'm a Jarl. I eat the most succulent meat, drink the finest ale, and hunt with the best hounds in the hold. Meanwhile, my very capable steward sees to the needs of the small folk and ensures that my hold runs smoothly. Being a Jarl could hardly be simpler. You should try it sometime. Dude, that's, that's not nice. Ah, it's you. Yeah. Selfish. Well, now we'll see if the stories about you are true. Okay. Bandits in my hold that I may have had a few discreet dealings with. The cut they were giving me was good at first. But now, now it's time to clean things up. Go and take care of it. Um. Okay, you, sir, are not nice. You create... Ooh, this guy needs to be removed from position of Jarl. That is just abuse of power right there. Total abuse. That is not cool. Uh, 